Hey everybody. So today we got a bunch of electronic um, stuff, electronic tool haul to do from Amazon. So please stick around and I'll see you guys there. All right, everybody. So we're going to do an electronic tool haul. I got some other stuff to put on, on the table when we're done with this box. I did already cut it open, so not really going to have to do much there, but I did not open the package. I just read the outside of the package, so let's try to get this open. Okay, so I got a couple items here. A bunch of them are in blanks. So, I'm going to just bring everything else in. And the bag is not a part of it, it just happened I had a bag. So, this is the Amazon tool haul that I picked up um, last week. I actually got everything that was in the green bag um, like five days ago. I was just waiting for the gimbal. Um, so, I'll run down what's sitting here and then we'll take some out of the packages. I have a, a Ulanzi ST01 phone clamp. I have the ST02 phone clamp from Ulanzi. I got two of the, the Ulanzi ST03 foldable clamps for your phone. They all do different sizes also. The, these actually go up to like 4.9 inches or something like that. Um, and then I got an ST05 um, 360 versatile phone tripod mount, um, which I thought was nice. I've actually looked at these. Um, I also have the ST02S um, coming in the mail, and I have the um, ST04 that I don't have sitting here. It just hasn't arrived yet. Okay, and then I got two of these. Um, two of these actual mounts. That go on the smooth gimbal. Take one out of the package. I got two of them. I got two of these. So there's five mounting holes on one side, and then there's a cold shoe on the other, and then you just um, twist this a little bit, and it swings open, and then you can quickly open and close the clamp it does have actual like foam insert on the inside so it doesn't harm whatever you're clamping to um, so I thought that was nice I technically picked up two of them 
This one is actually for the ZM Smooth 4 gimbal, but I, I picked up two because I'm thinking I can actually put it on a couple of other gimbals. Um, the ST01 actually came with this aluminum um, shoe mount for like a GoPro accessory, the two finger mount. I got, um, pick this up also which most of this all of these accessories are actually metal they're all aluminum so these two are black this one's black these two red ones are aluminum I picked this up which is pretty nice it's a, a bracket arm and this piece right here this knob that loosens and tightens it actually tightens and loosens the ends too, which I thought was very interesting. So if you loosen this a lot, see how loose it is? Which I thought was pretty neat. And then if you tighten it, see I want it like right there, I want this one kind of crooked. So you tighten the knob as tight as you can, and it actually locks the ends in. See how hard it is for me to move them? So I thought it was pretty neat. I picked it up as a another accessory that, for your heck, I give it a try. Um, this one actually came with the gimbal, it came in the bag. Um, this is just a quarter inch standard quarter inch standard and you can turn it and it swivels um, nothing special about these um, they are pretty nice though but i picked up two extras of them there's another one and then this one out there's the third one so I actually purchased two separately. They were only like three dollars, something like that. So I put take these out of the bags. Bag broke anyways. I put everything in my um, my large bag anyway, so I might as well take everything out of the bag. So they were only in the bags to show you guys. This is probably going to be a, a little bit long of a video. But here's the, the aluminum shoe mount. This one and this one you saw me take out of the the bag for the gimbal that I got which I'm not really too sure about these not really sure what they sent me extra it says JJC on it it's not as nice as the the ones I bought but I guess I, I bought this too it came with the gimbal oh well, that's not too bad it's got two metal brackets Probably will not hold my phone though. Smartphone stand. Huh. Maybe I'll give it to my wife and she can use it. Let's see what's in here. Some kind of um, tripod. It's got a <laughs> an allergy fell out. It looks kind of like a tripod. Huh. It is a tripod. That's very interesting. That's pretty nice. Ah. So you can use an Allen key on the bottom. This is actually really nice tripod. It's actually 
metal. That's a pretty nice surprise. Take the... What I like about the Ulanzi stuff is it actually comes in foam, which is pretty nice. This one actually has an Allen key also. So, the foam set aside. This is what this one looks like, the ST05. So you can actually use a 3 8 thread for bigger camera tripods and a quarter is also able to be used. Um, this, I'm not really sure what this hole's for. You know, it fits my pinky, but on the back of this, you have this screw that you can loosen and, and tighten and then just open these. You, these just fold open and then they slide. Um, and then if you loosen it's kind of like a grub screw if you loosen it it rotates and it locks like that and then you could just tighten it back up whatever position you want it in and the like I mentioned earlier the the ST4 and the ST02S those two I actually have coming but they're coming in this red color so, so I'm going to end up having four, four red and three black. This is the red one. These two fold up individually. This one folds down at one once. There's a quarter screw at the bottom. There's an ArcaCat style um, slide mount on the side, um, which is for more high-end camera equipment like tripods and stuff. They have ArcaCat style um, slides. It has a hidden cold shoe right here. So you can actually slide an item in right here. And what I like about this is it's just a easy screw. You just twist it to open it instead of having to to pull. You just twist, which I like I like a lot. And this one actually fits my phone with an actual otter uh, uh, yeah an otter box case. I'm going to be getting a new phone soon, but this is a Galaxy Note 8 um, with the S Pen. Um, and this is a just OtterBox Defender Series case, so it's got the rubber out and the two plastic layers. So, I'll show you guys. But. It actually fits the phone really nice. So I'm, that's why I bought these. My wife wants the new Galaxy Note 10. Um, I'm going to end up getting the Galaxy Note 10 when it comes out. So I bought two. Um, either one for both of us, me and my wife, or two for me when I'm using two phones or, you know, whatever the case is. I bought multiple mounts specifically for that, you know, in case, you know, Another one needs to be used or something. So, just figured I'd show you that. I pulled this one out of the box. So everything out of the box takes up less space. Okay. Right there. The S2 and S1 kind of look similar. They kind of look the same. This is the S2. 
This one also is a screw and it slides up. They just don't open as wide, but these do have like triangular shaped jaws. And these do actually fit the Galaxy Note 8 too. Um, it's kind of tight and the top piece right here is actually kind of bent a little forward when it's clamped to the phone, but it does fit. Now, like I said, the S1 and S2 don't look much different. They're pretty, pretty much the same. And then, go ahead and rip this open. It's gonna be a pretty long video. So, it's an OLED display ca capable with smartphones, cameras, digital cameras, GoPros. Um, it's got a focus to zoom in and out knob. This supports the Hero 7. Here's the box. And here's the case. It's just like the other Fiotech gimbal I showed. Comes in a nice case made directly for it. Pop this open. We have our 26650 3.6 volt 5000 milliamp cell, which is just a vape battery. Um, I've actually, I will demonstrate on another video, I actually put a vape, my actual 26650 vape battery, which is 3.7 volts. In, in the gimbal and it seemed that the gimbal worked a little better. You have your little box of goodies which some thumb screws charging cable a GoPro thumb screw that was pretty nice of them regular USB micro charging cable oh and it comes with a a three finger um, GoPro mount. That's interesting. It's in this box right here. Another box on the side. It looks like oh, a Fiotech um, phone mount. It's a pretty decent phone mount. Look, hold this phone. No. This phone is definitely too wide. But it's a nice phone mount. I'm sure I could use it for another phone. I have smaller phones. So, these goodies right here. Take this out. And your instruction manuals are up here, but here's the gimbal. It's a very, very nice gimbal. Um, the battery just, what I like about the Fiotex is you, this is the battery door. The other end's got a quarter inch threaded screw and it's all aluminum, which is really nice. Um, it's the thumb screw on the side, adjustment knob on, record, and just like the Fiotex regular G6, it's got this slider on the back and this double switch, but this is a very, very nice gimbal. We're going to have to shoot some footage with this gimbal. Um, I'm going to use a couple different cameras to shoot some footage. I'm going to do the my little digital camera. Um, we'll shoot some GoPro footage on this camera. I'll mount my phone to it. We'll see how it does with the phone. And um, maybe we'll even mount a DSLR. I don't know. But... That's the video I have for you guys right now.
get it back in the box. So, put this stuff back in here. Surprising how they got all this stuff in here. Let's stick it right here. Little thumb screws in here. Charge the cable. I don't need the boxes anyways. The boxes are kind of garbage. And it's got this little zipper pocket up here with the manuals. Manuals come in a nice little envelope. Some FAQs in Chinese and English. Bring all this stuff forward. There. So, that's everything that I got. Um, there, there's some other things on the way. From Amazon I got some um, an actual studio style um, voice recorder um, does Wi-Fi and a couple other things I bought a bunch of accessories for that a bunch of things for that some memory cards so that will be the next video um, thank you for watching please like comment subscribe and I'll see you guys on the next video um, and go ahead and hit that bell notification icon for future updates if you like that and uh, go check out my Amazon affiliate links. And again, thank you for watching, and I'll see you guys next time. Peace.